Hi fitness friends. Today we have a full body. I startle him every time I start talking like that. <laughs> I guess I must be talking louder to the camera than what I typically do to you, right? <laughs> Today we have a full body with core workout to do. This was written by our dear fitness friend, Kristen Ritter, and I decided to bring it upstairs and record it for you today. So for this workout, the only thing that I will be using that we don't typically use is my physio ball. If you don't have a physio ball, you can still do this workout. Um, have your weights and everything that you typically use to do my workouts with you, like your plyo box, um, variety of weights, your barbell if you have one, your sandbag if you have one. Um, and if you don't have a ball, you can use sliders or you can modify by doing the move right on the ground. All right, I do not have a warm up, so please push pause, get your body warmed up and ready to go. I'm gonna try to get this little guy down for his morning nap, and then we will get this workout started. I'll see you in just a minute. All right guys, I hope you are all warmed up and ready to go. We are starting off this full body and core workout with a circuit. We are doing one, two, three, four moves. <laughs> First move is a pullover to a press. So we're gonna do 15 reps, you do a lat pull over to a chest press. You can use a plate, you can use two dumbbells, you can use a single dumbbell. However you wanna get this done is completely up to you. If you're using two dumbbells, like I'm going to, you're gonna do a close grip chest press, okay? So I'm gonna go with two 15 pound weights, I'm gonna put my back on my bench and my neck on my bench, two. So if you are elevating on something just to have a greater range of motion like me, make sure your neck and shoulders are sturdy on that whatever you're elevating on, whether it's your ball, your bosu ball, your couch, a chair, your head and neck should be sturdy on it so you can focus on those lats. So putting my weights together, full pullover, and press. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven. Keep your elbows not locked out, but don't bend them too much either. Eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Bring it down. Second move in the circuit is 12 barbell sandbag, or dumbbell, back squat. So if you're using dumbbells, load them up to your shoulders. I'll be using my easy bar. I have 35 pounds on either end. That makes it a 84 pound bar, okay? So the bar is 12, 14 pounds. Okay, load up that weight however you need to. Make sure you do it safely, you've got 12 reps. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, and 12. Nice job, unload. Next is 10 staggered burpees, so staggered push-up burpee with snatch. So, one dumbbell, you're gonna go, or kettlebell, you're gonna do five per side. I'm going with 40s, keeping it on one side for five, and switching to the other. Here we go. Get that push-up first. Hop it up. That's one. Two. Three. 
three. Four. Five, switch sides. Five more. One. So basically, that's a hang clean with a press, okay? So you clean the bar up, squat down, press it, okay? Let's get it done. We've got eight of them. I'm sticking with the 84 for this move, for this round. <laughs> One. Five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, unload, staggered burpee with a snatch, sticking with 40s, five per side, here we go.
Then open up your weight. So your final round through this set, guys. Stay strong, keep your weight if you can. Take an extra breather if you need to. Here we go. Okay, 12 squats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12. Unload. Burpee snatch. Sticking with the 40. We only got five per arm. Let's do it. Stand your push up. One. Lunge. So I'll be using 25 for that. Hitting start right now. We've got a 10 second countdown. Starting with a step up. Reverse lunge switch. Rock it. Step up. Reverse lunge switch. So you certainly don't need weights. Rock it up. 
reverse lunge, out to switch. And one. So grabbing my 25, getting in a lunge, hopping to switch first, and then doing the clean and press. So left leg forward, I'm um, cleaning pressing with my left arm first. Bring the weight all the way back down. Hop to switch. Nice job. Okay, back to the rockets. Alrighty, my heart rate's back up. Here we go. Lunge. Here we go. Guys, both of these moves are so much core without doing sit ups, just so you know. You're like, where is the core focus? You're balancing, okay? You're doing a single arm move with a cardio move. It's all core and everything else. <laughs> sit-ups and that's just not true. That's great news for those of us who hate doing core work. Like me, I'm not a mat core work fan, so I compensate by doing tons of push-ups in my workouts, which is also a crazy core move. All right, so I talked this through the end of that. This move always goes so much faster when I'm talking. Okay. Second to bottom pair and the last to bottom pair is windmills. So I'm going to hold two 20 pound weights, one in each hand, staying on one side for the whole 20 second interval, and then I'll get the other side. Paired with a push up to a T stand and press. And I'll do those with 25s. Okay, so stay on the same side, same arm for that whole time too. All right, let's get my 20s, and then we're going to hit start. For the windmill, really lock your shoulder in tight, keep your core in tight, hop your one hip out. You've got a 10 second countdown. So I'm going to start with my left arm up. Run that other weight down your leg. Pop that hip out, arms are packed in tight, don't let that shoulder pop out. And one. Okay, 
going with one single 20 pound pound weight because we're doing a push up to a T stand and press. So an extra press in there. So stagger push up. T stand, press it. One extra press. Bring it down. Push up again. T stand, press. One more press. Switching back to our windmills. I'm going with my right arm up this round. So opposite hip goes out, run that weight down your left leg. Right arm stays packed in tight. I'm wally on this side, definitely, more so than my other. Nice work. Push up, T stand press, right arm for me this round. Here we go. One extra press at the top. One more push up. Keep those shoulders packed in tight. This pair is all core. And shoulders. Windmills. Back to your other side. So your left arm's up for me. Five seconds. Stand presses, back to the left arm. Full push up, chest to the mat. T stand, press. One more, press. Bring it down. Five seconds. One more push up. Nice job. Final two rounds here. Right arm is up for that windmill. Let's get it. Okay, 
your kick through. So switch it up. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stay in that lunge. Grab your weight. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shake it up. We're going down to eight reps. Each move, each side. So left foot forward, take it through with your right for eight. Here we go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Stay in that lunge, grab your weight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Switch legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Lunge it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. Shake it out. We are down to six reps per move per side. Grab a drink. Let's get it. Six reps. One, two. Three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Other side. One, two, three, four. Five, six. Here, Mikey. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, I'm going to be right back with him. All right, I'm back. Mikey has been quite a trickster. He's like talking in his sleep, but his eyes are closed. So I'm leaving him go until his eyes are open. <laughs> I can't see that on the monitor, so let's finish this off. Four reps per move. Kick through. One, two, three, four. Lunge it, row. One, two, three, four. Other side. One, two, Three, four, and row. One, two, three, four. Two reps, let's go. So he, one, two, row. One, two, other side. One, Two. One. Two. Nice work. Okay, guys. Next move. Bulgarian and single leg push ups. I know, I know. I'm going with 25s. 
10 on each leg, and we work our way down. So, back leg up, one leg forward. 10 reps, Bulgarian. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Single leg push up for ten. Here we go. Front leg goes back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Thank you, Kristen. Switch legs. Here we go. It's always fun when you can complain to somebody else for writing a workout. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Single leg push ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Down to eight. First leg again. Bulgarians for eight reps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Single leg push ups for eight. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Switching feet. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Fight for it, guys. I am. <sighs> We're down to six reps. <sighs> First leg again. This is where it gets easier. You only have six reps. Let's go. Plow through it. <sighs> One, two, three. Four, five, six, push ups. Six. Counting is beyond me now. Sorry. Switch legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. Single leg push ups. Yeah. 
almost there. Stay with it. Take breathers as you need to. Here we go. Four reps. One, two, three, four. Push ups. One, two, three, four. Other leg. One, two, three, four. Four push ups. One, two, three, four. Two of each. Let's go. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Oh, I'm so glad to be done with those. Okay, we have one final combo pyramid move. We bring a ball squeeze, shoulder tap, and then ball pikes. So, if you don't have a ball, put your feet up on an elevation to do your shoulder taps. And for the pikes, you're going to just walk your hands back to a pike or put your feet under on sliders and slide back and forth from pike. So for the shoulder taps, I'm of course counting on one shoulder only. Let's do it. Squeeze that ball with your feet on either side for these. You're gonna work those inner thighs and glutes and core. Here we go, 10 reps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Get your legs up on top. We're doing pikes for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, do the best you can, seven, eight, nine, Four, five, 
six. Take it for six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four reps. I'm just gonna stretch my shoulders and get it. Let's go. Squeeze your ball. One, two, three, four. Up on top, four pikes. One, two, three, four, and two. Squeeze it. One, two, two pikes. One, two. <sighs> Red face, sweat face. All right, guys. Good thing is, is that we are on to our finisher. The bad thing is, we have man makers in our finisher. And we're doing these man makers as a drop set. Keep your ball in your body because we'll be using that also. We're doing man maker drop set for three different weights, two reps at each weight, okay? So two man makers, then drop the weight, two more man makers, drop the weight, two more man makers at your final weight for six reps total, okay? I'm starting with 25s. Let's do it. Push up row, push up row. Up and in. Clean and press. That's one. Two. All right. Drop weight. We forgot two more. I'm going down to 20. So five pounds less per minute for me. It's one. One more at this weight. down again. Going to 15s. Two more man makers. And then we'll move on to our next move. Let's go. Side. So pick it up and twist to the side. So one, we have ten total. Two, squeeze tight, keep that back on the ground. Three, four, five. Other side. 
One, two, three, four, five. Okay, we are back to the top. Get the ball out of your way. Grab your heaviest weights from your man makers again. So I'm back to 25s. We have two reps. This is round two of four. I don't know if I told you we are doing the finisher four times. Probably did not. So round two of four. Let's go. All right, guys. We got Mikey here with us now. We have three more rounds. Man maker drop set to start. Two reps, three weights. Let's do it. Starting at 25 for me. obliques on either side. One, two, three, four, five. Other side. One, two, three, four, All right, back to the top. Round three. So get the ball out of your way. Heaviest weights for man makers. Lay that there. I'm gonna grab a quick drink. I love you. <laughs> okay, let's go two. Man makers, heaviest weight. Yeah. <sighs> 
<laughs> Much more like I like doing six man makers in a row. Here we go. One. Four, five, six, 
six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Obliques, let's go. Five per side. One, two, three, four, five. Switch it. One, two, three, four, and you are done. Awesome, awesome job. We're all done. We made it. Oh my goodness. Guys, that was a great, great full body and core workout. Did some different things. Kristen, thank you for the always amazing workout. Killer with the heavy weights. Dripping sweat, wet. Not a whole lot of cardio. Loved and hated the Bulgarian set. Okay, we're gonna go eat right now. Yes. Okay, I'll see you guys all at the next workout. Make sure you eat well, drink all your water, stretch it out, cool it down, be proud of your work. I will see you then.